Yo, what's up, YouTube? I'm back again with another video. And uh, this time's on a men cologne. It's a bargain cologne. And uh, this is a uh, Cuba Black. Uh, I touched on this before, but I wanted to come back, man, and touch on it again because this is more like a great fall, winter, scent, winter, winter and fall coming up right around the corner. So I want to kind of get you guys ready for a good fall and winter scent. And uh, let's check out the spray on this guy. Like I said, I touched on this before. Good spray. And believe it or not, man, the height was not pushed on this cologne too much. Uh, Cuba Black was one of the colognes that you didn't see too much of. Uh, you didn't hear too many people talking about it. But uh, it's a pretty great scent. I'm going to tell you what it smells like. It smells like an 80s powerhouse type scent. Like um, a Zorro, uh, it kind of reminisce you of Sun Homes a little bit from the 89, 88, 89, up and down. But it's a great smell. You know, it's kind of soapy, it's soapy, woody. Uh, it's just a great kind of fresh scent, you know, kind of out of shower, fresh type scent. But it's got a lot of power. It's a real potent powerhouse type scent. Like I said, you could be reminded that it's got the vibe of the 80s. It's got the vibe of an 80s powerhouse. But it kind of settles down as you put it on. But it's a great scent. The longevity and the projection of this, I get about four to six hours as I want it. I never want it too much because it's a heavy scent, you know. And like I said, this is another great fall winter scent. For those of you who like them classic 80s, like late 80s type scent, this is a great one to go for right here. Once again, it's Cuba Black. And like I said, it smells like a, kind of like a, it's dark, smoky, kind of soapy. It's a dark, smoky type scent. It's strong. Now, like I said, it reminds you from the 80s. That's what I get from it. Like those of you like them 80s powerhouse type scent, I highly recommend you get this right here. It's Cuba Black. It's a cheapie. Like this cologne may run around anywhere from $10 to $12. Give or take. And this right here is a 4. Point, I think it's a 4.2. This is a big one here. It's a 4.2 ounce. And um, it's an amazing scent, guys. And you know, some of you some of you guys like that classic old school type scent. Highly recommend you run with this one. The vibe is just right. The ladies will like it. Just a great scent for a cheapie. I wanted to bring it back because it's one of the good fall scents. Fall winter. This would be best. Uh in my opinion, it's too heavy for the summertime. Uh it smells similar to Sun Home, but Sun Home is a little bit more. It's more soapy. It's more soapy, but the projection of Sun Home is a beast. And the, the longevity too. But the reason why Sun Home probably could be worn, I would say, like, it could be worn during spring, maybe uh, late spring, summer, late summer, or something like that. You might can pull it off in fall. Not sure, though. I had to really get another whiff. I'm pretty sure I might come back and do a review on Sun Home. But uh, it's really heavy also, but it smells more soapy. It's got more of an Irish Spring type smell, Sun Homes does. So compared to this one, it was more of a, it's a soapy, but it's got like a, a soapy woodiness to this. Um, in my opinion, this one starts off more stronger, in my opinion, you know, than the Sun Home does. It's, it's more of a, it's got more of the wizardness to this uh, mixed in with the soapiness. But, you know, for the price you pay, uh, this Cuba Black is a great, it's a great cologne, guys. So I got to highly recommend it. Don't you like the powerful 80s powerhouse type scents? Go for this. That's what a ball look like. Like I said, this is a big 4.2. And this here, is, it's got the um, cigar shape also. Cap comes off like that rest of them and um it's just a great scent guys i just had to come back and 
touch on it again, you know. So, uh, it's an amazing scent. You know, I mean, you won't go wrong with this smell, you know, because I like it myself, you know. And it's, like I said, the fall and the winter right around the corner, you know. This will be a great scent for those seasons because uh, this stuff will be way too heavy for spring and summer. You know, it'll be get kind of cloying. It'll come back and, and uh, you know, it'll probably do something. You know, you don't want to wear it. It's too heavy, you know, for this time of year. But when fall hit, as we get them cooler temps, cooler days, cooler nights, longer nights, this stuff will be perfect. That's why I want to come back with this video. Um... But uh, this is an amazing scent. Don't get me wrong. Like I said, ladies are like this. Pretty sure some of you guys like the more classy scents, classier scents like these. Go for it. You won't be disappointed. And like I said, this is a cheapie. And um, for the price that you pay for this, you cannot go wrong, man. I highly recommend it. Uh, it's what I like close up. Cuba. Black. Amazing scent, amazing scent. All right, so guys, I'm gonna wrap this one up. And uh, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. And uh, I want to thank all my viewers and my subscribers for watching my videos. And in the negative comments, I gotta block you away. So just save it. Ain't no need to even say nothing about it because I'm just gonna block you for real. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace out, YouTube, and don't forget to go get this Cuba Black, guys. Stuff smells amazing for the fall and the winter. All right? Peace out, YouTube.